important conversations around police violence and inequality in justice systems at large. My research seeks to add to these conversations by investigating the role identity plays in legal practices. I suggest thinking comparatively and relationally about these issues by looking at case studies in Canada, Israel, Palestine, and the US. My goal is to think of new ways to change the relationship between law and inequality and help in shaping lasting reforms. What prompted me to do this research is realizing how much more there is to know about racialization in law. I began understanding that working as a human rights lawyer, serving as the founding director of the Multiculturalism and Diversity Clinic at the Hebrew University Law School of Jerusalem. I represented individuals in courts from different identity groups, and doing that, I saw the role played by identity in legal procedures. Like, what does it mean to be a hijab-wearing woman in certain areas of the world? What does it mean to be a racialized person? What does it mean for law? My experiences as a lawyer, a legal activist, and a racialized person myself made me realize that we need to develop a different kind of knowledge on this question. In my current academic work, I continue to explore the way we produce such knowledge, this time through transnational perspectives. So I am a lawyer, and lawyers and legal scholars usually read verdicts and court documents to make sense of reality. Only in that way, too much of what's involved in lawmaking remains hidden from the eye. My research uses instead a combination of methods. I read court documents, but I also do observations, conduct interviews, look at other artifacts, including my own memories. In that way, I think, we are better positioned to look at connections between law and culture, as well as to trace subtle processes that shape the law's relationship with discrimination. I would like to see my research becoming part of the global conversation on law and discrimination. As a Vania Scholar at Osgood Hall Law School of York University, I'm grateful for the opportunity to be part of a community that is deeply committed to advancing equality. I believe that my research can help in tailoring new tools for policymakers in this field. I think as societies we can do better, and I believe that academia must take an active role in the fight for diversity and against inequality.